But what is going on, aliens? So I've taken a break from your standard pre-workouts, and I've just been using Hearthstone Native Coffee as my pre-workout. Now I'm mixing two scoops of creatine in there. It's unflavored creatine, so you don't taste it at all. Just swirl it around a little bit. And this is actually my favorite blend of the Hearthstone Native Coffee I've had so far. It's El Salvador. It's a dark roast, and it really tastes like chocolate. So I'll put a link in the description so you guys can check that out. Now, what we're gonna do today, we're gonna bring you to the studio. We're going through a heavy biceps workout and we're actually pre-fatiguing back. So we're hitting biceps before back. Now I'm gonna explain my whole workout frequency and my new style of programming as we get later into this video. Now, since we're gonna be at the studio for a few hours, because we'll stay after we do our workout and go over some app stuff, we're gonna get some models in to get some more exercises for Exerprise in there. But I always just like to show you guys what I meal prep. So this is just your standard teriyaki chicken with some asparagus. It's about 400 calories. Then I always pack two snacks with me. So just some cantaloupe. This is around 50 calories. And then Snickerdoodle Lenny and Larry's protein cookie. Guys, I'm obsessed with these things. Now, it says on the back, only half a cookie is a full serving. Who the hell eats only half a cookie? So the whole cookie is about 400 calories because I'm going to eat the whole thing. Now let's take off to the studio, guys. And we are at the studio now, guys. We're gonna start off with some heavy bicep curls, working up to a top set of five. Then after my top set, I'll explain a little more of my program frequency and how everything's going down. Let's get into this workout. So every single day I'm working up to a top strength set of that day's muscle group focus. Now I'm working out six days a week, so that muscle group focus changes every day. I'll go through legs, chest, back, shoulders, triceps, and obviously today, biceps. I make a point to make every major muscle group have its own day's focus, and I'll work up to that top strength set, but that's actually the only strength set that I'm following for that specific day. This plan I'm actually currently doing is more hypertrophy and endurance based. So after that top strength set, I drop down to a four by eight, and then I'll use all accessories after that main compound to just destroy myself with that hypertrophy and endurance rep ranges, and it's really correlated to a lot of strength gains because I'm not pushing my body to a point where it's overexerting itself, but I'm pushing myself every day to a top, basically a max. So over a six week period, I'll go to a six rep max, a five rep max, a four rep max, a three rep max, two rep max, and then the sixth week I'll drop down to that one rep max, which is a video you recently saw me maxing out. Now this program, this is I've done a full split of it, and this is my second time around doing it. I've seen significant gains in my strength, and obviously my size and endurance aspects have significantly increased as well. Chase that bicep pump, guys. Now we're about to hit some back. If you've never hit back with pre-fatigued biceps, it's something new I've been trying, and it really helps you increase that mind-muscle connection because you gotta squeeze that back as hard as possible since you've taken out that synergistic bicep muscle group. Let's get into it. Let's get it! and my workouts with a weighted app exercise, and then I followed it up with a body weight hit circuit using my Exerprise app, and then after we hit abs using this app, we followed up with a Tabata cardio circuit using the Exerprise app as well, and that's the end of the workout. Next. Got that sweat going with that Tabata cardio, guys. Now I got a huge announcement for you. The sets and reps feature for Exerprise is officially out, guys. Let me show you how it works. First step, open the app. Then you're gonna select your muscle group. So I'm gonna choose chest, back, upper abs, and then I'll choose cardio. And then after you select the muscle groups you wanna work out, you pick your equipment availability. So I'm gonna choose dumbbell and barbell. 
And then we head on over to the new feature. So instead of time intervals, you can choose sets and reps. So you can choose strength, hypertrophy, or endurance, then how many exercises per muscle group you want to do. These selections determine how long your workout's going to be, which we calculate for you. Then you hit generate my workout, which will bring you to the workout summary, which is a preview of the exercises that the app generated for your workout today. And here you'll have the option to even further customize your workout by changing things around if you wish to do so. And if you do decide to do so, you hit the button in the top right to customize. You can change your reps, you can change your sets, and you can change your rest periods. And then the normal customizable features with moving exercises around or choosing alternates. And then when you're done customizing, you hit that play button and you head on over to the workout screen. It'll give you a five second countdown to begin your workout. And now it's on you to complete your first set. And when you finish it, you hit set done. And then it will time your rest period for you so you know exactly when to begin your next set. So I hope you guys like this new feature. We already have a lot more in the works. If you guys ever have any ideas, please leave a comment. I'd love to hear them. This new sets and reps feature is dope, guys, and really takes extra price to a whole new level, and it's only going to get better and better because we're going to put a ton more exercises now into the app, and we got even more features on their way. Let's get filming these app exercises. What's up, guys? It's Lucky. So we're going to get the studio set up to do some app filming now. We got Lucky here with me, yep. and then Whitney's going to be coming in later. Let's get into it, guys. Awesome. So rock and push it and start like back like this and then rock into it forward and then push backward. Yep. On. facing this way and the barbell's going oh. off the screen. Oh. It won't show up like that because this side will be off, oh, okay. off the side so it'll look like the background's completely white. All right, we're done. You know? Yeah, let's go. Nice. Okay. Hi guys, I'm Whitney. Guys, look at this filming difference. So this is with not through the camera lens and then through the camera lens, completely white in background. Sit low, get 90. There you go. Low, there we go, one more. Nice. One fluid motion like this. Just a big superset of two exercises. So up, out. Yep, exactly. What you're doing is alternating side to side like a chest press. And since it's in front, it's gonna this part won't be in the app, so it's only gonna show the barbell from here and back. Relax. Perfect. It has been a long day, guys. We are all cleaned up and done with app filming, YouTube filming, workouts. Everything we had to do today is accomplished. Now I'm going to go get my redneck on and go to the NASCAR Xfinity races. I'll get some footage for you guys. Starting NASCAR out at my boy's house. We're pre a little bit. Then we're going to head on the party bus and then head all over to New Hampshire to go to NASCAR. Are you vlogging this, y'all? Yeah. What's up? Yeah, you can flex. <laughs> Mikey. Home from Cali to go to NASCAR, yo? <laughs> steak off. <laughs> like I it. took a steak off the ground. <laughs> <laughs> Folks. <laughs> Gotta play some games. Conversation here for the boys. Strange as others. Also, I think it's gonna be terrible. Oh, yeah. I think me and Ryan are on the same page here. We don't want to go to that. Curb. No. Again with that. Dude, you gotta, you gotta drink, man. So we actually got a limo instead of a party bus. Not really sure how that happened, but this is pretty cool. We're gonna be a little overdressed uh, car-wise for NASCAR, but 
still pretty dope. I've never been in a limo before. Yeah, brother, we're in NASCAR now. <laughs> Hash Brown America. Hey, expertise right there. No days off. That's not a hundred.